Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. I am simply OLA. Have you got used items, used containers, or recycled items that you want to throw away? Well, maybe at the end of this video, you might change your mind in throwing away soft objects because we will be exploring junk modeling. If you may know, through this junk modeling, I've been able to create a pig. Can you see my pig? Can you see the tail? I've made butterflies using paper tubes and muffin cases with pipe cleaners. I've made a binocular. Through this, the children are able to thread, thread um, the shoelace through the paper tube. I've also made a laptop. If you can see, there are numbers and letters there. And I've used 3D to construct, making them have the knowledge of maths and literacy. We've made a lamp here. That is expressive arts and design. We have made um, been able to make my um, robot with boxes, 3D as well, as well as um, um, yogurt pots. And you can see I've binded together using a cello tape. I've used a different brown cello tape here because it's um, stronger. So um, I've made. A scarecrow here. Some may say a scarecrow. And also an old woman with afro hair. I would say it's an old woman with afro hair. Somebody may say it's a scarecrow. Whatever it is, I know what I've made and I'm taking ownership of it. And I'm sure that is what the children will be saying as well. Well, I've been able to also make um, an elephant using a soft can and um, I've made um, dog's head there using various materials. I've also got things that you can use to bind and then glue as well. I've got rubbers. Just provide the children with the opportunity to um, use tools and as they are using these tools they are learning to manipulate they are learning properties of objects as well junk modeling offers children the opportunity to construct and design objects using recycled materials it is not usually about the end product it is more about um, the process rather than the end product it is about how they have achieved whatever they have achieved, not what they have achieved. Although what they've achieved also come in play because they are excited about whatever they've achieved. But you know, by the time you start asking them, how did you arrive to what you've done? They begin to tell you, give you, you know, reflect back and tell you how they've achieved it. So you're giving them reflective skills and you're also giving them um, you know, the language and the social um, development as well. And then one object, for example, could be used in various ways. For example, I've got this um, soap bottle in my hands. The soap bottle could either be turned into a fish because it's got the shape of a fish or I can turn it into an aeroplane. For example, I've constructed um the the pig mm, oink oink using a bottle a soft bottle and the same soft bottle has been used here as an elephant it's like an elephant's head i could want to continue with the process of the elephant head if i've got a bigger box i could create a body for the elephant so it is not always about what they have achieved. It is always about asking them 
how they've achieved whatever they have achieved. Majority of the items here have been left uncovered because I want you to see what materials that I've used. You can encourage the children to paint. You can encourage them to wrap the boxes or the objects um, before make, putting the fine details as well. They can also decorate using sequins, glitters, feathers, etc., etc. So if you do have materials that you consider as junk or recycled materials, please do not throw them away. Put them in a safe place. Um, let your children explore them. Put them in a place where it's reachable for them or accessible to them, where they can explore all these materials. You never know. You're building tomorrow's scientists, tomorrow's technologies, tomorrow's engineers, tomorrow's mathematicians, tomorrow's designers. You never can tell what these chunks can achieve for your children or where it can take them up to. Um, at the same time, do make sure that all resources are safe. Exploration. Right, if you do like my video, click like, subscribe, and share. And tell me how you got on with the activity when you eventually carry it out. Bye!